Most of us know a paranoid personality when we meet with them. The key elements, of course, are their suspiciousness of friends and relatives, uh, their tendency to be uh, almost like the avoidant, hyper-alert to the possibilities of threat. But rather than um, feeling inadequate and aversive, they tend to be provocative in their interpersonal behavior. They tend to be irascible in their mood. Uh, they are defensive, but in an angry and hostile way much of the time. So their suspiciousness does not lead them to aversiveness, but rather contentiousness and often belligerence. Some have what might be called mini delusions, small, minor delusions, but nothing grossly pathological. So you uh, said you're from New York. New York. And what is it that uh, brought you here today? It wasn't me, I'll tell you that. Well, who was it? I was ordered to come here by the courts. Uh-huh. And their reason? Not my reason, my wife's reason. Uh-huh. And hers? Her reason? Because I won't give her the money that she doesn't deserve. Is this for alimony? Of course, what else would it be for? Uh-huh, and why doesn't she deserve it? Because she's the one that's wrong, it's not me. Uh, okay, tell me about that. How is she uh, wrong? Well, she was fooling around. Uh -huh. How long was she uh, involved? Since before I was married, I don't even know if my children are mine. Why should I give them any money? Uh -huh. Okay, when were you first uh, uh, sure of this? I've known for a long time. It's not a question of when. Okay. How did you find out? I just knew it. The way she acted all the time when she would come home or I would come home, like she was afraid of me already, like she had done something wrong. Uh-huh, so it's mostly a feeling. She tricked me into it. She just wanted to keep me hanging around so I could take care of the kids so she could just go on and fool around. Hmm. What did you mean by that? Hmm? By what? By that grunt. Like, you don't believe me. <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? How am I looking at you? Like you don't believe me. Listen, man, I tell you, she's the one that you should be examining. Why don't you ask me anything about her? Am I right in thinking that you would rather not be here? <laughs> would you want to be here? <laughs> oh, I guess you do. You have to be here. Wouldn't that be great if I just got up right now and walked away? Then they would think I was really crazy. Uh -huh. How do you feel right now? Why are you asking me all these questions? What do you care? Is there something over there? I keep hearing things like there's something over there, like this is being recorded or something. What is that thing over there on the wall? Why is there a curtain on the wall? There's no window there. Is that a mirror? <laughs> you guys are all the same. You just like to watch every little twitch, every little look. You think you can tell exactly what a person is thinking or what they're doing. <laughs>